All right, so I told you yesterday that we were going to have a goodbye video today. Um, I don't think this one's really sad. I think this one's pretty good. This car definitely gave us a lot of fun. I know you guys didn't get to see all of it because she was bought and built and run and all that stuff prior to us doing YouTube. This is the Lumina that I took to Rochelt and was able to get the third place trophy with. She's definitely been used up. We're starting to get some pieces of the wagon stuffed into her. Um, I took both rear hubs off. I know that the light's not great in here. Hold on. Yeah, we got both rear hubs. So I'm sure she's going to cooperate greatly going up the trailer. Obviously she's got a pretty crooked stance as it is. Let me get up to the front here. You can see Wagons produce a lot of crap, so we still got plenty of stuff left in the wagon, and you'll see the update on that one tomorrow. We've got her hooked up to the winch. Got a tripod set up over there so you guys can watch me fumble my way through trying to get this thing up onto the trailer. So let's see if we can get her loaded. All right, well that certainly wasn't the easiest loading we've ever done. You can see the stuff I put in there. <laughs> Boy, this car was a lot of fun. Aside from maybe loading it, but it certainly could have been worse. Obviously, we've had an issue with ripping those rear wheels off, so to have those hubs was beneficial, and I can't get away with constantly having my car is sitting out on the trailer because somebody called the cops on me. So, figured push her into the garage, get a little bit of time to work on it, get a bunch of stuff put in there. And now I finally got a day off, let's get rid of the junkyard. So, last step here, really all I got to do guys is pop my diggers off. Let this thing rest on the trailer and uh, we're gonna get her out of here again going to that same yard right down the road um, if I can get some film of this thing getting hoisted I certainly will all right just waiting for this big truck to get off the scale what do you think guys oh can't see it I look good in a hard hat this place makes you wear a hard hat see what kind of weight we can get three mile an hour on the scale I don't know that I can idle at that speed but we'll do our best all right looks like we're gonna wait in at 11 to 80 
let's go get this thing off the trailer. All right, doesn't look like we're getting the big claw today. We just got a guy with a forklift. There she goes. Everybody say goodbye to the Lumina. Oh, hey, by the way, recognize that one? Might as well say goodbye to the tracker while we're at it. All right, drive back up, run back over the scale one more time. Get a little bit of cash to go towards the next one, right? All right, let's bring her back across. Bump, bump, and bump. All right. And 88.40. Well, I must have ate one too many tacos. And there she is. Final result. 2,420 pounds. They docked me 100 pounds because I was honest with them and told them that I put tires inside of it. Even though it didn't have any tires on it. Whatever. 122 bucks. We ain't getting rich, but hey, that should supply beer for a while. Thanks for following along, guys. Appreciate it. As always, get goosed.